and welcome back to another video so welcome back to the Tenerife vlog this will be Tenerife vlog number two obviously the first one included a pack with me so it was a bit long to include the whole of Tenerife the whole week in one vlog and the pack with me so it's going to be vlog number two which is going to be our final three days which I'm so sad about we still have three whole days like I have to stop I have to stop like worrying about how long the end of the holiday is away but I, I know that a lot of people do that I'm sure everyone is guilty of that so yeah we are currently on Friday so we've got Friday night Saturday night Sunday night and we have the whole of Monday so we do still have a long time to be fair but I thought I would start the vlog here because we are currently about to go to the Hard Rock Cafe which I'm so so excited for I would recommend watching the last one first because you'll understand the whole palaver we had with switching hotels and blah 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 we actually got the Hard Rock included with Tui because we had to change hotels so yeah we're going to the Hard Rock tonight we're gonna go around seven ish i think i thought you'd be able to see that a little bit better if i put you here so this is the outfit the top and the trousers i'm really liking this actually i wasn't sure when i first put it on but i think i think we're good to go just get a little bit of flounce but i mean you can't wear some holiday wear can you actually wear it so this is the little look today okay here we are about to go into the hard rock gonna have a little wander around um, nearby the Hard Rock. It's all so pretty. Guys, heels is always, always a bad idea. <laughs> My feet, I'm dying walking backwards to the room. But here's the pool. Good morning everyone and welcome to day two of the second vlog of Tenerife. Last night I hardly vlogged after the hard rock. Honestly, you probably could tell by the amount of food we ate last night. I was literally right off I got back. We were meant to be having some cocktails. I was literally like, I can't. There's literally no more room in my stomach for a single more thing honestly it was amazing though like honestly the restaurant was so so good if you're coming to tenerife i definitely recommend going because it's such an experience like the music hopefully we'll have included some of that but because of copyright we won't be able to include too much but honestly like everyone was singing along like everyone was in such good spirits so yeah we definitely definitely recommend a trip to the hard rock um so yeah that's what we did last night honestly i thought last night i was like i'm not gonna eat for the rest of the holiday and best believe i'll be at that breakfast buffet in about 10 minutes i have because i've burnt so badly this holiday i've got p20 sun cream now which is like this one that you put on and you don't need to put it reapply it through the day but you need to put it on at 15 minutes before the sun so i'm just gonna sit here let the sun cream soak in and read my book um i am reading the book one little lie by lauren weisberger and it's actually really really good i'm not too far through it because we haven't really been sat around the pool too much but today is going to be like a chilled pool day i think we might go and try and find a beach a little bit later on um so i'm going to mostly read my book all day and then probably just check out the beach later but of course i'll take you along and yeah i'll take you to the breakfast buffet as well i usually do go for a multi course breakfast and have like an omelette and the hotel crafts, but I'm gonna just go easy today and have one course. So yeah, that's the plan. I'm gonna sit here for a little bit and read my book, and then I will take you to breakfast. Okay, so this is today's pool look. We've gone for an all pink. And if you can really see, it's like this pink top from Cider, pink shorts, and I've got my little beach bag. It is the game to reserve a sunbed that's going on already. So we've found a beach. This was literally about 15 minutes from our hotel. It's called Las Vistas Beach. So we're gonna have a little look. It looks super calm actually. Let's go and have a look in.
everyone i literally haven't vlogged since the beach i'm just doing my evening skincare well i'm doing my moisturizer before i put my makeup on for the evening this is the glossier i think it's called after balm honestly it's just incredible and it's so so thick you know just like what you need after the sun super glowy so we've just got a little drink at the bar gone for a gin and tonic and cam has gone for an amstel which has pretty much been the classic this holiday hey good morning guys um it's now the next day obviously we're currently about to go to breakfast but i thought i'd just update you on the vlog what we got up to last night so obviously we went to the buffet i did try and vlog but the clips were so bad in the bar because obviously this holiday if you can't already tell the difference in quality i really hope you can't but my camera is currently away being fixed so i'm going to vlog on my phone and the lighting is really good in the day like and i think the quality is fine in the day just in the evenings with the dark light it's just not as good so yeah i'm really sorry about that the camera will be back asap so don't you worry especially for the tulum vlogs the camera will be back but anyway back to the story um i thought i should update you what we did last night so we went to the buffet and the buffet was actually incredible last night like we had a full-on like indian we felt like we ate out at like an indian restaurant it was incredible um, then we went to the lobby bar usually we sit by the pool bar in the evenings and watch the entertainment but we just fancied like a really chilled evening yesterday was our second to last night tonight is our last night so i'm gonna vlog all day today and tonight and then tomorrow is our last full day we don't fly till like 9 p.m tomorrow so there's still two full days in the sun which i'm very happy about but yeah i thought i'd just update you last night we went for dinner and then for drinks and then obviously it's the next morning now so we're gonna go to the buffet buffet for so many rounds of food honestly i'm just making the most of it we can get healthy when we get back, but we don't have the big buffet full of all-inclusive Nutella crepes, waffles, omelettes. Just right in front of me, I can't help myself. So yeah, we're going to go to the buffet now. I'll give you a little view of the pool. Like I said, there is a bit of a competition here of who can get the sunbed, and I don't think today we're going to get a good one because it's about 9am now, and honestly, everyone goes down so early and gets their sunbed. So I'll show you the pool now. Um, but our plan today, I think, is just to stick around the pool, and then we're going to Bianco's tonight, I think. This is how our pool is looking today. No one's in it yet. There are some beds here, but obviously they're in the shade. So we're not sure where we're gonna sit. But let's be honest, even all of these ones, they don't stay in the shade all day. So we'll be fine off to breakfast and then to find a spot around the pool. Okay, we found our spot. I'm very happy with it. I'm reading my book. This is where we are. It's actually really good because the sun has just come to this area. So no one wanted it earlier, I don't think, but it's just come out, so that's just great. So I'll be here for the foreseeable reading this book. The only thing is it's a little bit slow. I'm on, I'm not very, I think I'm here. Okay, this is going to be the last night of me doing my makeup on the balcony, which is so, so sad. I honestly just love evenings like this, like back from the pool, freshly showered. I have got a sarong on, by the way, like I'm not just okay with no clothes on. Um, but I'm back to my makeup, like I've said, ready for dinner tonight. We are going to Bianco's, which I think I've mentioned. Um, if not, then we're going to Bianco's, which is one that we've been recommended. I've seen so many people rave about it on Instagram, and I've also, um, one of Cam's friends literally recommended it a couple of days ago. So we're going to go to Bianco's tonight, I'm going to do my makeup on the balcony now, like I said. But I've got my pink gin, as always, ready on the balcony for me to do my makeup. Maybe I'll do a little time lapse of me doing, of me doing my makeup, because I haven't actually included that in the vlog. But yeah, that is the plan, we're going to Bianco's. I literally have about 20 minutes to do my whole makeup and hair, which is a bit of a stress, and I'm so burnt. Like, I don't know how this holiday, the sun's so hot that it's just burning straight through sun cream. Like, I literally had Factor 50 all over my chest, and I reapplied it one time, so I've had it on all day, and I still burnt this bad. And my back is now peeling, so yeah, the burn situation is really bad this holiday. Like, I've never burnt this bad ever, even in like the Caribbean, I've never burnt this bad. But we move, we'll have to just aloe vera when we get home, even. But yeah, we're going to enjoy our last night. I'm really excited. I'm going to do my makeup now. And then I will update you with the full final outfit, which is so, so sad. And the final little evening with us. We are just walking to 
dinner. I've gone for an all green outfit today. I feel like my chest is literally glowing and it feels like it's burning because it's so burnt. But anyway, we've got our reservation at Bianco at 6 30. So we are going to be about 10 minutes late, nothing new there. Um, but yeah, we're almost there. We're just taking a little walk from our hotel into Play Las Americas. It's about a 15 minute walk. But the issue is, this skirt is rising with every step I take. I've already taken the green moment extremely far tonight. We've got the green sunglasses, the green bodysuit. This is like a low back bodysuit. The green mini skirt. I also have green sandals on. And the all inclusive band is green. So if anyone can tell what my favorite color of the summer is, then take a guess vlog properly when we get to Bianco's but I thought I would just update you and I'll show you the little walk actually because if you are thinking of coming to Mary Lanza it's nice because there's literally a pathway pretty much straight into Playa Las America so we're all good Ooh. okay so we just got to Bianco we're just looking at the cocktail menu they all look so nice and this is the setting in here it's so beautiful So our drinks have just came and so is our food. We've got bread, olives, oh my goodness, we've got this massive meat platter, we've got arancini. This is our last night, so for some reason we seem to have gone big, but So we are now back from Bianco's. Honestly guys, that was incredible. Like the meal was so so good. We had a Sharon board to start, which is like a deli meat Sharon board. We had arancini. We also have, what else did we have? We've had pasta for main course. I had one with prawns. Cam had one with chicken and with bacon. And honestly, would definitely recommend. The vibe in there was just incredible. Like it was so cool in there. It just really felt like a proper luxurious, like a really luxurious restaurant. So if you come in Tenerife and you're looking for that kind of vibe, then 100% go to Bianco's. That was definitely our favorite meal of the holiday. Obviously we have been all inclusive for most of it. But we have been to Nebula, we've also been to Hard Rock and we both said that um, Bianco's would be our absolute favourite so yeah definitely go there, the cocktails again were incredible but, yeah I'll update you with what we do for the rest of our evening, I think we're going to play cards, we're going to have a few drinks and then we're probably going to go back and back, we do have the full day tomorrow which I will include we're going to go back to the beach and we're just going to have a day of chilling so it's currently our last day, I thought I'd just vlog on the balcony this morning to update you so we're about to go to the TUI reception desk and see what time they're picking us up. But we think it's going to be around six, half six-ish, because our flight isn't until almost 10 o'clock. It's a night flight. So that should be nice. We've got the whole day here. We're about to go down and get a sunbed, go to breakfast, you know, the drill. Pretty much the same as every other day on holiday. I think we are going to try and go to the beach today, though. The beach was by the incredible McDonald's where we had the McFlurry, and I really, really, really crave another one before I go home. It comes fine, because like I said, he comes back to Tenerife next week so he's not going to be missing any of these things so i'm like we need to prioritize the mcflurry and the beach and the pool so that is what we're going to be doing today everyone is pretty much already up everyone's around the pool we've been packing we're all packed so we check out at 12 and then there are change rooms and stuff by the pool so you don't even have to pay for like a late checkout room or anything like that so it's actually all worked out pretty perfectly so i will update you at breakfast i'm gonna have the exact same thing as always put my hair in this plait because i want it to be wavy for the final photo of the holiday that i want to take i have one more swimsuit to take a photo in and yeah so i've got my hair ready to be wavy in the plait the outfit today is this little top which is yellow with little oranges on and then i've got these like floaty white trousers on okay last visit to the beach oh i'm so sad look how pretty i'm wearing my Primark swimsuit today that has this little matching throw which been to get pictures. Oh guys, it's time to say goodbye to the beautiful reception. I'm honestly so sad. Ignore my crazy hair, I just realised there wasn't an end into this holiday vlog, so I thought I would end it here. I really, really hope you enjoyed the two Tenerife vlogs, like I said. If you hadn't seen part one, I'll link that down below so you can go and watch that now if you want to. But yeah, honestly, watching it back, like editing it back, has just made me miss it so much. Knowing you're like sat there all day, like, I wonder what they'd be doing at the hotel at this time. Like, oh, we'd be going for dinner at this time. And I'm like, oh, I just want to go back. I literally miss it so, so much. But yeah, I really, really hope you enjoyed the Tenerife vlog. 
um like I did say in this video, it was filmed on my phone because my camera is away for repair. So hopefully you haven't noticed too much of a big change in quality, but I'm really sorry about that. And the camera will be back. I rang up yesterday, it should be back very, very soon. And it will definitely be back for the Mexico vlog. So if you did enjoy this one, then the Mexico vlogs will be in early September. And I'm so, so excited to share that with you. Um, holiday vlogs and birthday vlogs are just like my two things. They're my favourite things in the whole entire world. And just having the memories there to look back on is just so, so nice. And I wish I'd been doing YouTube for so much longer so I could look back at like all the holidays. But anyway, we're here now. We've got all the vlogs now to look on. Um, if you do want to watch other holiday vlogs, I will make a little playlist on my channel for like all the holiday vlogs that are on my channel, if you're fancying that. I sometimes do watch one vlog and I'm like, I just want to watch like loads of these. So I will make a playlist full of all the holiday vlogs. But yeah, like I said, definitely stick around and subscribe if you want to see the Mexico vlogs. We're staying in between at Tulum and Playa del Carmen. So we're definitely going to go to Tulum as well, which is just the most exciting thing in the world. I've been watching all of Sophia and Chintzia's Tulum vlogs and I'm like, again, so excited. So yeah, I would love you to stick around for that. I'm also going to do quite a lot of content this summer on like holiday clothes styling. So let me know if there's a particular store you want me to do like a haul for. For your holiday, I can try and put together some outfits of inspiration for you all. But yeah, like I said, thank you all for watching. I love you all so much and I will see you all in my next one.